Happy Monday. Um, so good to talk to you guys this week. I have some foods to show you that I just found that I'm super excited about. Um, so I'm just going to get started and um, I'll start with the weigh-in so I can get that over with. Okay, so this past week, um, I didn't have anything too crazy. Um, I did go to some outlets and always in like those outlet kind of places, they have the yummiest food. And when you're walking around all day, there's something about the food that's there. So I ended up just getting a Starbucks coffee and I got non-fat cafe mocha, no whip with one pump so if you can remember that that is five points or i can post it on my blog if you want but it's well worth the five points you can take a sip and walk around and feel like you have something you know and it's delicious i think it's delicious um but okay so back to the weigh-in this week i did use all of my um the 49 allowance so I was down 0.8. So this is probably the first time in like forever I was down less than a pound, but it's very close to a pound. Um, so was I happy with that? Hmm. I was kind of like, ah, oh, okay, whatever. It's 0.8 and I'm down. So that brings my total to minus 128.8. So I can assure you this coming week I will not be using my 49 point allowance. So, um, yeah, sorry for looking down. I had to look at the, uh, the numbers and stuff. So now I wanted to share a oh, one other thing. When I was at the outlet, I had gone into Annie Ann's pretzels. And oh my god, the smell is amazing coming out of there. If you've ever had one of those, it's like the butter, delicious cinnamon smell coming out of there. So um, my husband had gotten his, of course he had to get one of those pretzels. But there was a lady in front of us, and I was just going to get a coffee. But there was a lady in front of us, and she had to be close to 500 pounds. And she was ordering, and there was some kids with her. And, um, you know, one kid was hers and one wasn't. And, um, I don't know, it just really saddened me because, you know, she, she was really large and she was ordering, I don't know how much she ordered, but even her daughter said, oh, we're getting lots of food, yay. And um, her daughter was also obese. So it really saddened me to see that. And, um, of course, I can't say, oh, you know, uh, let me help you or anything like that. I would never do anything like that. But it's just sad to see people that are struggling and or maybe they don't know. Some people know, don't know better. and. I thought that could never be a possibility, but it is, and some people don't know any better, and some people don't care. I I don't know how, but I don't know if that's true that they don't care, or maybe they just seem like they don't care. Either way, enough of that. So now I'm going to show you some of the stuff that I found at the store this week that I'm very excited about. Can't wait to try some of them. and. Um, here we go. So, the first thing that I was super excited about is I found these Delight Jimmy Dean. They are honey wheat flatbread sandwiches. They're 160 calories and they are, this is the egg whites with spinach and mozzarella style cheese. So, yum and yum. And these are only four points. I found these at Giant Food Store for those that are going to be looking for these. Lowest, probably the, one of the lowest calorie and point sandwich that I've seen made besides maybe Weight Watchers. 
But these look absolutely delicious. Look at that. I'm sorry, as always, I don't turn the camera around. Sorry. But um, anyway, you get the idea from Jimmy Dean. Delicious. Four points. It's crazy. I don't eat a lot, you know, tons of packaged products. But the ones that I do, I want them to be low points. And they're for, you know, making my life easier. Like when I'm on the run. I would have this for breakfast, lunch, or dinner. So that was a good find. And I also found these popcorn chips. They're from Special K Kellogg's. And this whole bag is three points. Um, the bag is 0 0.77 ounces. It's not a huge bag. So this wouldn't be like one of my top things because it's three points. But anyway, to take something on the go, it's 90 calories for those of you that want to know the calories. And it says they're sweet and salty. So I will be trying these probably later tonight. And another thing, for some reason I've gotten on this uh, this kick with soups. And I'm going to be making some of my own soups. And I actually have a recipe that I put together that I've been meaning to post. But I haven't posted yet because it's, um, I wanted to be able to put it on my blog as well. So this is the Progresso Light Chicken Vegetable and Rotini. And look at all the little vegetables in there. Now what I would do with something like this is I would bulk it up with other vegetables because it just makes you more full. It's two points. It's endorsed by Weight Watchers. It's two points per um, serving. Okay. The next thing that I found, you probably saw that I posted yesterday. I made a, not a recipe, but I put together something for this. This is Dan and Light and Fit Greek. These are called blends. They're new. And this one is called, um, toast, what is it? Toasted Coconut Vanilla. When I saw that, I said, yummy. And it is delicious. I had it, if you saw my video I posted yesterday, I made um, sort of like an islandy style uh, dessert out of it with some pineapple and coconut. So check that video out if you, if you want. These I found in Giant. They're 80 calories. A new one that I've never seen before. This is Light and Fit Dannon. It is 80 calories and it is cheesecake. Sorry, I did not mean to sing right there. But this strawberry cheesecake, I can't wait to try this. I haven't tried it yet, but I'm hoping it is delicious. So I'll be trying that. And that is two points as well. Then, um, actually, a subscriber had told me about this. I had never seen this soup before. It's also endorsed by Weight Watchers, and it is chicken pot pie style soup. So, I don't, I know I'm going to be adding something, something to this. This one's 100 calories per serving, and, um, there's two servings in here, so. I will be excited to try that one. I love chicken pot pie. And there's one other thing I had. I don't want to make these videos too long because I know it's supposed to just be the weekly weigh-in. But I love to share stuff with you guys that I found that maybe you can try to make your life easier and to make, make it more fun. And, you know, it's just better when it's more fun. And, okay, so this one is by South Beach. South Beach Diet. And these are good to go bars. They're cinnamon raisin. You get five in a package. They have nine grams of protein. So I do love that. And they have free fiber. Anyway, they are um, cinnamon raisin and they have like an icing on top of them. Yeah. So these are three points and they're 130 calories. So, I believe that's it for this week. Um, so, check out my other recipe. Look for the yummy yogurts that I found. Um, most of my stuff I find in Giant Food Store or ShopRite or Acme or BJ's. 
BJ's is a big one. I find a lot of good things there. So um, I hope you enjoyed this. Uh, I hope you guys are doing good. I've heard from a lot of you. Thank you so much for all your comments. I've really been enjoying them. And um, I will see you at next weigh-in. Bye-bye.